Good evening. Thanks for being with us. I'm Eric Franke. First tonight at 10, focused on flooding. Homes along the Wisconsin River in Sauk and Columbia counties evacuated tonight as high water creeps up to a record 20.6 feet. Tonight's top story centered around Highway 1651 and P. That's just outside Portage, where water from the Duck Creek is causing chaos. The 19th, David Douglas checking in. Just back from Columbia County tonight, David. The concern so far, Eric, has come from water coming out of the Wisconsin River, but now there's a whole new place they're looking at, an area creek that looks more like a lake, and business owners fighting the flood say they've never seen it this high. It'd be a beautiful view of the sunset over Portage if the water were where it should be. And nobody knows better than Jim Poole. The floor of his flooring business is covered in several inches of water. We had just put down new carpet about a month ago, put new drywall up, new trim, new doors. At least he'll have samples to pick from when he chooses his new carpet. Fortunately, his warehouse is off-site. The big focus here is getting the water out. I got two generators and five pumps. Last night, Cool's parking lot just had a big puddle in it, but by this morning, it had turned into a full-fledged flood. We did sandbag in front of the doors just in case. Oh, when I got here at 6 this morning, it was starting to come in the back. None of this water is coming from the Wisconsin River, but a soggy Duck Creek, which has spilled over its banks. Water that's also surrounded two sides of Jim Price's lawn equipment business, which for now is dry on the inside. We let the country plumber park all their equipment out back, out in our back side of our lot there, and yeah, and that, so try to be neighborly. Just carefully don't trip over anything. Thankfully, Cool does have flood insurance, but it won't stop him from having to start over now that his showroom is sopping wet. It's frustrating because it takes time. You know, with the economy the way it is, and then you're going to have to be shut down to do this. So how do you still run a business, show samples that you don't have a place to show them? Tough spot. At this point, it is a waiting game, waiting for the water to go down and just hoping it doesn't get any higher. Even though the Wisconsin has crested, the water from the duck may still be rising. And the news just gets worse the higher it gets. Story will continue to watch News 3's David Douglas. David, thanks so much.